many organizations conduct what they call as an employee engagement survey periodically. And they don't know what to do with it after. So we actually have a process to real-time bring change in employee engagement levels, those surveys, I think those are important. Unwrap is really about divulging the survey results. Oh, okay. Our approach is unique because we work with behaviors. So SOG is the acronym, Seek, Observe, or Outcome, Listen, Evaluate, Evaluate, and that's the process we do. So, uh, Sunil, how did this, this process of SOG start uh, in your mind? Right, so um, I'm sure you know that Stimulus started classically as a training organization, and 97 when we started, training was the focus, and has been for a long time. What we realized is we are causing little change. We are focusing on a layer or our participants. This could be a two-day, four-day, whatever program. What we realized is that culture change is a requirement in organizations. Mm -hmm. When we started doing research here, we realized uh, that we required a different approach and SOLVE evolved. That's the way I would say it. When SOLVE originally started, we started this and when we copyrighted this, this was copyrighted as a coaching and a consulting model and an approach. Today, when we are looking at it, I think there's been a lot of inputs. We've learned from some of the customers we've served. This has evolved. Uh, but this is a what I would call as an infinite program. And I think you, if you lead an organization, if you're here, mm -hmm. you want to grow. I don't think there's a finish line to growth. There's not a finish line to culture building. There's nothing called being the best manager, being the best leader, or dad, or mom. I think. You haven't got an end line. This is a continuous process. Interesting. Okay. Having said that, uh, could this project actually fail in any way? It could fail, uh, and I've seen it fail. Uh, you know, in a couple of locations, it fails if people are doing it for the sake of doing it. If there's no senior leadership skin in the game, if they are not committed, I think this can fail. Yeah. Interesting. Yeah. So we. Briefly, could you summarize you know, what's in it for the organization? Sure. So for me, I believe if your employees are committed, then I think a lot is achievable. And employee engagement is a limiting factor to a lot of other pieces. So for me, the real take is employee engagement leads to a happier customer. And it shows in the customer engagement. And if more of your customers are happy, then I believe it leads to the end net result, which is ROI and productivity and profitability, uh, which is really the intent of most organizations. So that's really the outcome. And most people don't see this foundation. For me, it's to work on the foundation, which is employee engagement, which is what the survey and this process does really. Very well said, Sunil George. Thank you very much for sharing your insights. So there you have it, friends. You've heard it from Sunil. We would like you to explore the use of this tool, okay, solve from stimulus consulting. Thank you, Ben. Thank you.